man, it's ever windy today. Today I'm helping my grandpa out by cleaning up around here on the farmland. I have to put all this crap over here, all this dead wood, onto the trailer. And we gotta haul it all the way to a dump area. But the, the catch is, all this area over here is all poison ivy. And I have been literally attacked by poison ivy, or if you might call it stinged several different places, on my hands, on my arms, even on my legs. They should be, I believe, on a Fear Factor episode, trying to get wood that's covered in poison ivy. What do you think? You may think we're done, but this is only half the melon that I gotta clean up. There's still a whole lot more needs to be tidy up. The poison ivy is still stinging it like crazy. Damn, that hurts. Didn't know that was covered, but you learned the hard way, don't you? Here is the final amount. There's still plenty more to, to be placed. I'll have to come back for round two, but as you can see, there's not enough room anymore to place anything new. This whole wagon is covered with dead wood and old vines. I don't know if you can hear me or not. The poison ivy is, is still hitting hard. Stings like a bugger. Hopefully when I come back to the farm, I'll have some kind of like treatment to get rid of it. This is what happens when poison ivy stings. It attacks on your arm, on your hand. See it right there. There. Also, it attacks me also by the leg, left leg. Just wish that there was none. I just wish that there was not any poison ivy here. But what can you do? Ah, more dead wood. Let's see if I can get this in. This well right here has very fresh water, but it's not really clean, but it's spring water. My god, this cup is so old that it literally has rusted to death. Fresh water, it's not really clean. <laughs> it's super cold. Oh, that is nasty. <laughs> 